All this month, get up to $50 off any Android smartphone from Appalachian Wireless. Any Android you desire. All $50 off with two-year agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. According to AAA, the national average price for a gallon of regular gasoline is $2.65, up almost 30 cents from a month ago. In Kentucky, the average price for regular is $2.57, up more than 32 cents from a month ago. Worrisome? Yes. But according to Ron Pruitt, the chief operating officer at Childers Oil in Whitesburg, even while the country continues to deal with the effects of two hurricanes, some relief may be on the way at the pump. The experts say, number one, the price is peak. Number two, the price is going to be coming down subject to bumps in the road. And that what we believe is that we are actually going to return back to a very, very similar price market once all of the refineries are back up. Pruitt said Childers Oil, as well as many other fuel providers in the region, depend on the gas terminals in Knoxville, Tennessee for their gas and diesel supplies. The supply lines feeding Knoxville, he said, were affected by both Hurricanes Harvey and Irma. In a period of about 10 days, the average rack price in Knoxville, Tennessee went up 50 cents. One of our goals and one of the things we're instructed to do is to do everything within our power to keep gasoline and diesel fuel in our customers' locations and in the double quicks. Pruitt said it's likely some slight increases in gas prices could be seen in the near future, but he said industry experts believe gas prices, with more refineries coming back online, will soon begin to go down and stay down, barring any further supply issues. At that point in the near future, they're saying and they're speculating we'll see some volatility, but we will get back to almost an identical market as to what we had before this happened. Pruitt said there remains some uncertainty, especially while assessments continue post-Hurricane Irma. But Childers Oil customers and customers of other suppliers may have seen the worst of the hurricane gas price bumps. In Letcher County, Chris Anderson, EKB News.